Fresh off his re-election bid Tuesday, Macon Mayor Lester Miller reflected on growth across the county in his first term. Now he's projecting more in his next four years holding the gavel. Anthony Montalto met with the mayor to hear more on his plans for shaping Macon. Our community hasn't grown like I thought it should over the last decades. I think in the last three years we've grown a lot more than that. So I think that's something that people are going to have to get used to, some growing pains. Uh, you may have a little bit more traffic than you used to, a little bit more longer wait in the line for your food than you used to. Uh, so those are some good challenges that we like to have. That's what Miller told 13 WMAZ Wednesday. It sounds simple enough, but there's a lot more to it when you ask him. Like the number of jobs that we have in our community. Uh, in the last, since 2022, uh, we have over 1,700 jobs between new jobs, about 13, 1,400, and retained jobs. That brings more people to Macon. Miller points to Thursday's announcement of 600 new jobs at First Quality's South Macon diaper plant. All those people need somewhere to live. Miller says according to planning and zoning records, there are hundreds of new homes in town. And that's why it's such a rush in Macon to build housing that everyone can afford. And that's why you see all these uh, complexes going up in Macon. But despite the new jobs, census data shows Macon Bibb County has fewer people living in it than in 2020. Those records show the county is home to about 156,000 people. But Miller says he thinks the county is undercounted. Based on the traffic counts we get each and every day, certainly I believe by the time we do the next census, Macon Bibb County is going to increase. Uh, so his staff is at work trying to make sure the county is ready. So we're putting aside more money for roads. Uh, we've been doing a beautification effort. We've been uh, trying to hire as much staff as we can, uh, giving support wherever it's needed. And even though he wants the county to grow, Miller says it's important to keep that goal sustainable. He says down the line he'd like to see about 200,000 people calling Bibb County home. In Macon, Anthony Montalto, 13 WMC News. Mayor Miller says the county also has record tourism. Last year, visitors brought about $14 million to the county. He says this year, Bibb's on pace to make $22 million from out-of-towners.